talk, let's talk the good stuff, shall we? Jalen Brunson, once again, just being a leader. 43 points, fourth straight of these 40-point-plus games. Uh, in terms of importance to a team, if we look at the landscape right now, playoff teams remaining, his importance to his team moving forward, where does that rank? I mean, you look at Jokic, I think he's he's obviously very important. Now, when, what have they done for me lately? They're down. Oh, we'll get to that. They're down 0-2. Yeah. So that, you look at what, to me, right now, it's it's Jalen Brunson and Anthony Edwards. These two guys are so critical to their team. They're so aggressive. They're the go-to guy, and there's absolutely no question. They're big in clutch moments. Uh, you know, and what he's doing every four games in a row, 40 plus nights, crazy. he's efficient, 14 of 14 from the free throw line. He's taking care of the ball for the most part. It, it's just, it really is unbelievable. He continues to get better and better. And each game is a bigger moment where he steps up and he makes the big shot or he makes the big play. Um, and he just seems just like he's just such a nice, just humble, like star <laughs> in this huge mecca of Madison Square Garden just dominating. It, it, it's unbelievable what he's doing. So he's he's right there with Ant and Jokic, in my opinion, on just this is why MVP voting also should be later. I know Jokic is in, and SGA hasn't played in a while and Tatum hasn't played in a while. But it's for real. I feel like all I'm seeing right now, because the series are that more competitive, are, is Anthony Edwards and Jalen Brunson. Yeah. So, and, and so it's like, shouldn't that factor into the whole MVP of the season? So that's a whole other argument, but Jalen Brunson's been phenomenal. He's been uh, a blast, a revelation, if you will, Lou. I, you know what? Th we're going to start the conversation, might as well, because when you talk Knicks, they're obviously legends. It's a city of legends. Um, and I know we're living in the moment, and I don't want to be a prisoner of that, but... Where can we put him now that we're starting this conversation of greatest Knicks, perhaps? Well, we got to let him build. We got to continue to do what he's been doing. He's playing at a high, high level. He's excited the New York fan base. He's got people excited about New York Knicks basketball again. They're winning. They're playing well. It's exciting. It's great for the league. It's great for everybody, especially Jalen Brunson. Who saw this coming, <laughs> right? Who knew that he would be the guy that would bring this team back to to some type of prominence in, in the East. And, and it's an exciting time. Now we're talking about ever. This is a legacy piece right here. Let's see what he let's see what he does. Let's see how the, how this ends up. You know, if they win this game and then mess around and lose four in a row, this is a completely different conversation. We gotta allow things to to be completed and be finished. He has a long career ahead ahead of him in a New York Knicks uniform. Let's see what happens. But you know, when you look at it, you got guys like Pat Ewins and and Willis Reeds and, and and all of these type of guys. You, it's, it's going to be hard. Uh, Walt Frazier. It's going to be hard to just say, wake up today and say Jalen Brunson is the best Nick ever <clears throat> outside of those legacies. But he's building. He's in the right. He's in the right direction to be mentioned with those guys. You, you know what this reminds me, of, Michelle? It reminds me of Lynn Sanity. No, don't say that. It's, I was thinking it and I wasn't going <laughs> to say it out loud. It is great, but it's not going to end. Like in Lynn Sanity okay, was okay, a okay. nuts like, that was two like or a three trend. weeks or whatever. Yeah, that was like a fad. Yeah. This is like it's just when when does it stop? Like Never. like four, it's it's incredible in how parade. consistent. Look at those numbers in the playoffs: thirty-seven, it's, it's like nine. He's efficient. It, it's unbelievable what he's doing. So it's like the garden now is totally turned into this Lynn Sandy type vibe where it's they're not going to see the Knicks win next game. They're going to see if Jalen Brunson can have forty again. Like it's it's starting to become that. Like it is crazy what he's done to this franchise in such a short time. Knicks were a laughing stock a couple of years in yeah. a row. Like you know what I mean? They oh, are wow. like New York Knicks are back and it's because of Jalen Brunson. I mean the city the the chance afterwards outside, I know it's New York and it's everything's crazy and and uh, amplified, but it, it is like the streets are filled. And also, he's doing this with just like his pops on the bench as an assistant yeah, coach. It's like beautiful. I can't think of a cooler situation. With his buddies from school. With his Who college teammates that he won a national championship down the street. That well, by the way, we just knocked off the Sixers where I played college and won a Natty. Like it's unbelievable it's what's like happening. It's like a movie. Good things just keep happening to this dude. I know, and I'm scared.